Hello everyone, my name is Amy Everest. I'm the Adult Services Librarian at the Prairie County Public Library. Welcome to Miss Amy's Favorite Things, 12 Days of Christmas Edition. And today, Miss Amy caught the gingerbread man. And she's going to teach you how to catch the gingerbread man. A um, few things you'll need for this project are you're going to need a candle. You can actually do a flameless candle or an actual uh, votive, just plain candle. And I went with flameless, so. And um, you're going to need some wax paper. You're going to need tissue paper that you would find, you know, in like the gift wrap, uh, the birthday um, aisle. You're going to need a regular printer and you're going to need some computer paper or cardstock. You're going to need scissors, hair dryer, and a few optional things are the lantern, the ribbon. Um, you know, of course, you don't have to have these stuff, but. I'm going to keep my gingerbread man locked up in this little lantern, but maybe some fairy lights to go with it, and uh, if you're looking for something to attach a bow to something, you might need some pipe cleaners. Um, this oven mitt is, of course, it's, um, it's optional. This gets a little bit warm while you're doing it. That's why you have it. And um, to get started, you would need to uh, select you an image based on the size of your, your candle. I went with a gingerbread man. And how you do this uh, will include the link that I used from Pinterest. And it was actually a, a um, Halloween project that I converted over to Christmas. But um, you would attach a piece of tissue paper to a piece of cardstock using a uh, tape. Uh, which you'll have to have. I chose uh, washi tape to do this. That's what the tutorial suggested. Said it works a little bit better than scotch tape. So you tape this on your um, your cardstock, and you when you get ready to print, you just load this in with your paper so that it will print on your uh, tissue paper. So once it comes out, uh, you are then going to take your scissors and you will trim. You will cut out as close to the image as you can get of what you want to, um, that you're going to be applying onto your, transferring onto your um, candle. So, as you can see, I've already got mine cut out. And I'm just going to simply take him off the cardboard that he was attached the not the cardboard sorry card stock I've already got him here so I'm going to come around because I want to be visible from both sides I'm just going to lay it just like this and smooth him out and then I'm going to take my wax paper I'm going to lay it over my image just like that and I'm gonna hold it tight now I'm gonna take just a regular hair dryer and using quick mo movements I'm gonna go over and over and over this until it adheres onto my candle so turn this on I will be back in just a minute to show you my finished so it's been maybe probably less than two minutes since I went over this entire image and you see my, my wax paper is still on there. Now I'm just going to slowly peel this off and as you can see my image is staying on to my candle. And voila, I have another gingerbread. So, I'm just going to take my gingerbread and put him in his gingerbread man. Put him in his new home. And lock him up because I have the gingerbread man. And so, until next time, stay safe.